Hi guys, uh, now these are a whole bunch of Crix scrap thralls made by Privateer Press uh, that I painted up. Uh, there's three of them and uh, I'm quite happy with how they turned out. Uh, now these were initially going to be a competition entry into a competition that was being hosted by Mateo0661. However, unfortunately I was very late in getting my entry in. Uh, in fact, I was about half a year late. Uh, they took that long to uh, complete, which is pretty tragic. Uh, but I had a good time doing them and I'm quite happy with the results. Uh, so, you know, uh, if anyone's got any uh, constructive criticism or uh, advice for next time, uh, they think I could have done something better, then, uh, yeah, by all means, uh, feel free to throw it in the comments section below. Uh, but really, I was quite happy with how these guys turned out. Uh, in particular, I was really pleased with how uh, the paint shipping went. I was happy with that. I thought the flesh was quite nice. And also, I was particularly happy with some of the metallics on these guys. And uh, you'll see some close-up shots of that later. Uh, but I was really pleased with how the gold turned out. I really managed to get a lot of contrast in there. And then just the really weathered and bashed up kind of rusty uh, steel or iron uh, metallics. Uh, I was really happy with. Uh, this was something I was kind of experimenting with. It was something I wasn't really used to doing at this particular point in time and uh, I'm still not really. Uh, weathering isn't exactly uh, my uh, forte uh, but I was really happy with how it turned out and uh, none of that was done uh, using any sort of pigments or anything uh, so I thought that was kind of interesting. Uh, so here you can see some close-up shots of the uh, gold I was talking about and I was really happy how I managed to highlight that because in the past I've had a lot of difficulty uh, doing nice high contrast highlights on gold particularly in highly textured areas like this.